A doctor at Tulane is working on a discovery that he made that could revolutionize how we diagnose certain kinds of cancer. It's really encouraging. This medical reporter Meg Ferris reports his research could mean people with hard to treat cancers have a much better chance of survival. Film star Patrick Swayze's battle with pancreatic cancer was short, and then we watched as Jeopardy host Alex Trebek went through the same illness. Locally, many also saw East Jefferson General Hospital CEO Dr. Mark Peters face the same condition. It's a tough cancer because it's usually found in a late stage because there are no early oh, symptoms. We haven't started testing the MD Anderson sample yet. Well, now a researcher at Tulane, Dr. Tony Hu, is working on his discovery that could revolutionize diagnosing pancreatic cancer early. Early detection is the key to save the people, save the patient with cancer, and uh, is also is extremely important for the patient with pancreatic cancer. He first identified a secretion that is released from pancreatic tumor cells into the bloodstream. One cell can secrete the 10,000 uh, extracellular vesicle every day, and the vesicle can stay uh, stably in the circulation. And he also created a machine that can find these particular nanoparticles in a drop of blood, differentiating them from other EV cells. Now in a project sponsored by the National Cancer Institute, Dr. Hu is looking at blood samples from pancreatic cancer patients at MD Anderson. The samples range from stage one to stage four. Over the next two years, he will perfect his test, figuring out what each stage looks like. Then a California company will help him get FDA approval, moving it into production. Hopefully three years later, and we will see this IC on the market to serve patients. The technology is called a liquid biopsy. This is important because pancreatic tumors are more difficult to see in a scan. This could soon mean that a pancreatic cancer diagnosis is no longer a terminal illness for 90% of those it touches. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News, Medical Watch. Smoking, obesity, diabetes, and getting chronic pancreatitis are all risk factors for pancreatic cancer. Having a family history is part of it too.